Oh man, I hope I have ammo. Oh, I do. There we go, guys. There we go. Oh, the peace ball to start out with. That keeps things a little more straightforward from a cursed cannonball's perspective. And we've got the music going. And that was another peace ball. Yes, it was. Yes, it was. Both crews have their anchor up. They're sailing side by side. What was that? That was a beautiful anchor ball. And the, and the, uh, the grog ball is not slowing down Carides and her crew very much right now. Oh, no, it's not. Not at all. No. guys you gotta be kidding me here we go remember when the when we got cracking eight seconds into a race that was crazy someone needs yeah, to put that out was the a beacon, fun time. by the way someone in the uh <laughs> on the slooper or something put out the beacon there we've got a megalodon back in play this is owl over with bb and her crew trying to get I out of their the way if the case they try to harpoon um, it all depends on exactly what the Megalodon does. And of course, when you hit the Megalodon, it pretty much runs in a random direction. Um, but BB and her crew are behind a little bit right now. And let's see, are they gonna harpoon? No. Man, it's pretty sweet to have a signature move, even though you're only racing the for the very first time. <laughs> it's not easy to do. And she put together a really good crew for this thing. Okay. And we've got a Meg bite coming on BB and her crew. It missed? It missed? Fine. I didn't know they could miss. We're gonna be all right. <laughs> I can't, the Meg gave up. Maybe the Meg's a fan. Wow, okay. And here we go back to my view and you can see this is a nice looking lead for Carides and her crew right now. <laughs> a nice looking lead. Look at them go. They've got full billow. They're absolutely flying into Galleon's grave. <laughs> this is a nice looking lead. So, Krotok, here's the question. Can they get okay. with this lead? Do you think they can get their snake back before BB and her crew have a chance to stop them? Let me have a look here. Oh, yeah. There you go. Check out the oh, map. Wow. And there we go. Carides has three on the island right now, and it looks like they're just leaving her behind on the harpoon to change the direction of the ship that has all three sails up. Let's go over to Owl's view. It is definitely hard mode, that's for sure. It is definitely hard mode indeed. Maximum effort. Carides and her crew are about to grab their snake. Yep, follow, uh, follow the murder. Follow the murder. <laughs> Uh-oh, we've got a bit of a situation here with Carides and her crew. They are a bit stuck, um, and they're definitely... Oh, no! Oh, no! This isn't great, guys. This isn't great. Carides is in trouble. She's alone on her ship. The murder going on on the island. There we go. No, no, we've had a camera guy die, but let's watch it happen in instant replay. They've sent Shumba, who has been crushing it in this competition. Oh my goodness. Wow, look at that fight. Fox die, Shumba, Greeninator, and Coop. BB is in there too. Neither crew has their snake on board as of yet. Oh, man. Neither crew. Um, now, I will say, Carides has fixed her angle here. If you look at this, this is back to me on her ship. She's got the angle fixed. And, yes, both crews have it fixed now. Both have their snake on board, don't they? Here we go. We're going to have a ram here. Oh, just a little love tap between the two. Do any Cursed Cannonball exchange? No. No one had a Cursed Cannonball saved for that situation. I believe... Let me see what this last one is. 
It's a peace ball is the only cannonball left uh, for Carides and her crew. And there they go. There they go. They're off. BDXH is behind. They haven't got their snake on board yet. And there we go. Carides and her crew have full billow. Kaitsu is here on the camera ship, I believe. And here is Owl's view over with BB and her crew. Owl, can you see their, um, their snake? They finally got it. They're coming. Oh, look at the harpoon shot right over Fox Die, who was going to try and stop him. They harpooned him over their heads. That was a great shot with the harpoon. Nice. Very well done. And here we go. Look at how beautiful this is, guys. They're heading into the storm. They've got to get that back sail angle. They're about to get full billow. And here we come into the Isle of Last Words in the middle of a storm. It makes everything approximately 30% more epic when it happens in the storm. <laughs> is that Protoc, do you think 30% is 40? Would you say 30%? 30 for 40%, something in that neighborhood? I mean, it's got to be something like that. <laughs> Let's go over to Kaitsu's view in a moment. We've got this is Owl. <laughs> Do I feel like there's an imposter? <laughs> I see that. I can see you, Crowchuck. You don't say nothing. You're not supposed to mock the legendary race commissioner. New rule. <laughs> This is Kaitsu's view on the Isle of Last Words. Look at that shot, ladies and gentlemen. Look at that shot. Oh, that is beautiful. We're doing a competition in that possibly is, the most beautiful game worthy. ever made. Straight up. It's just a beautiful game. Well, I have news. We've got sharks. Oh, there, look at the shark down there on the bottom, guys. Ah, I'm going to get you. <laughs> that shark is pissed. They're thinking about harpooning a Meg in the storm. That is a bold move. Meanwhile, we pull up to the Isle of Last Words. Let's go back to my view. And here we are. That is BB and her crew. They're coming down fast. Meanwhile, Carides and her crew. Oh, look at that shot with the harpoon. Snagged the gem right out of his hands because they're leaving an ambush behind to stop BB and her crew as they come in to try and make the exchange. Now the question is, can you get their anchor up? The anchor's up, they're dropping sails. Are they gonna get out of here before BB and her crew can do anything to stop them? They're not. There's their last, oh, what? that was a miss. The win. Oh, it's a tough one. There's another one. That was I'm, not a miss. I'm, what was it? <laughs> Grog ball. So we've got some action going on. Let's go over to Kaitsu and see his perspective on this all coming in. Little bit of a delay. We're going to stick with Kaitsu's view for a minute here and watch what happens on the Isle of Last Words. Meanwhile, I feel personally attacked. <laughs> meanwhile, Garrity's and her crew are moving away, and this is the battle that's about to ensue on the Isle of Last Words. It's going to be desperate. BB and her crew have got to go quickly. And you see Shumba lurking. Oh, he's he's excited for the fight. We've got Owl in the water. Um, okay. I think we're missing some action there on the Isle of Last Words. Okay. All right, here we go. Yeah, it's different because of the different way it's plugged in. It's all good. We're doing fine. It's all good. Here we go. Okay, back to my view, guys. This is my view, and this is Carides and her crew closing in on Skull Keep. Look at that. Look at that. They are about to fire themselves. They've been getting really close to the fortress, which seems like a really, really solid idea. 
Um, what cannons are those? I believe those are the hunter cannons, right? Are those level 50? Uh... What cannons are those? Uh, somebody in chat knows. Somebody in chat knows. There we go. We've got Carides and her crew shooting Bleed. off. They still have two purple cursed cannonballs, by the way. Um, this is this Owl is with Beatty and her crew. They are leaving the Isle of Last Words right now. That ambush that at least partly included um, Shumba managed to slow BB and her crew down enough. Now let's take a look at the line. So this is Kraken's fall. BB and her crew are right here. Wow, look at that. They're trying to take a wider angle to try and close some of that distance. That might work if they nail those long distance cannon shots. That's the line though, look at that. That's a fantastic line for Carides and her crew. This is BB and her crew. This is gonna be close. This is, it's still anybody's race. This is a lead, but not a definitive one. Um, I think we're gonna have Kaitsu on the ferry momentarily. This is gonna be a sail game, I think. Uh-huh. Who takes that better angle? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Guys, be nice to Dread Pirate Bot. <laughs> Carity's crew is, I believe, about to come through. Yeah, they're through the ferry. They're back on their ship. I see a skeleton sloop. And here we Boy, go. They're staying well enough away. Yeah, they're at least watching the race. Knows enough. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Shumba with the almost like, no. sag on the barrels. Oh my goodness. Nearly. They're back, but they've got a little ways to go still, and they're going into the wind. Neither crew has full billow right now. Let's check in with Owl. It looks like Owl has BB and her crew. Have they shot off yet? <laughs> BB and her crew they, are uh, off the ship and headed to the yeah. ferry. Let's go to the Ferry of the Damned with Kaitsu. BB and her crew are going to be there momentarily. Meanwhile, Carides and her crew have yet um, to do anything that's going to lose them this lead. And they are looking a lot like they want a spot in the tournament in November. Very much so. I don't know how BB and her crew are going to catch up when you go back to my view. That is it. It's right there, guys. It's right there. That's victory. We've got that blue flame. We're going to wait for that to change colors. Oh, I told him not to bring blue. That's all right. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. They don't have their shots onto the island yet. It isn't over until the beacon is lit, as no one says. Here we go. We're over with Kaitsu's view. He's going to be working on getting up there. Carides and her crew are off the ship. They're on the island. They're headed for the beacon. We don't have it lit yet. We don't have it lit yet. We've got an empty beacon right now, but oh, come on, cat. Not right now. That hurts. My cat just bit my foot. Oh, Rude. My. I didn't do anything. Vengeance. Shoot us there. There it is. <laughs> there it is. Look at it, folks. Unbelievable. That is astounding. We're going to watch the instant replay of the instant replay of the beacon getting lit by Mr. Shumba himself. Artemis Fletcher, thank you so much for the thousand bits. Thank you so much. Hey guys, if you haven't already, drop me a quick follow over on Twitter. That would be awesome. Drop me a quick follow on Twitter. Okay. Hey guys, that's it. That's it. We've got a new race of legends champion. What an astounding week at the race of legends. Let's go ahead and talk to uh, Carides and Shumba. Uh, Crotech, I'm going to drag us both over. Unbelievable. No. Unbelievable. Hey. You guys, 
Okay, Shuba, the oh. PvP was legit this week. Both races, we saw you holding them up at Galleon's Grave, and th were you the only one that got left behind at the Isle of Last yes. Words? Unbelievable. He's a one-man army. That's absolutely astounding. Very well done. Very well done, indeed. The crew who shall not be named is now one the Race of Legends, <laughs> very first Race of Legends celebrity showdown. They've earned themselves a spot in the November tournament, the anniversary tournament. Um, guys, what an amazing week. Fox Die jumping in at the last minute as a sub. The drama was real. Wow. Um, thank you guys so much for coming. What do you guys feel like made the difference in that last race aside from Shumba murdering so many people? Anchor ball. Yeah, that anchor ball was. Oh, that anchor ball was clutch. The anchor ball was there. Yes. You guys got that lead and then basically protected it the rest of the race, didn't you? Oh, that's fantastic. Um, I guess uh, I can't. I can't hear Carities or any of them. All I can hear is Shumba for some reason. That is super weird. I wonder why that is. Um, <laughs> I don't know. I can hear Crotuck. Did I hear revenge happening? No, that was a skeleton and everyone died. Oh no, everyone died. That's a shame. All right. Oh my goodness, guys. I, we were gonna try. <laughs> wow. I'm the best translator. Sorry guys, I'm a little hoarse. Can you hear me now? Yes. I can hear you now, yes? Carities. Yes. Yeah, she's here in Kenya. Oh. Yes. Awesome. That was an amazing <laughs> race, Carities. That was great. That was a lot of fun. Wow. Oh, it made me nervous. <laughs> oh, second, second oh, win. Watch out. Watch out. Two wins in a oh, row, God. guys. Currently Never undefeated. Ended. Currently undefeated. Okay, guys. Okay. Here's what we have coming up, okay? Because we've got some important things. A week from tonight is the Curse of Legends. If you don't know what the Curse of Legends is, you've got to check out the page on the website, um, which I'm going to post into the chat momentarily. It's kind of a cool experiment um, that we're going to try. Uh, we'll see how it works out. Um, but it's basically uh, Infection from Halo, but in Sea of Thieves. That's the long and the short of it, right? Um, okay. Yeah, it's, it's going to be awesome. Um, boy, let's see. Um, I'm, let me jump in real quick here. Uh, let's jump over to BB and her crew and just say thanks to them for coming because they've been fantastic. Hello. Hello. What an amazing race, you guys. Oh, Thank no. you so much. Oh my god, not again. The amount of barrels that are coming up there. <laughs> yeah, it's, hazard it's hazardous up there. <laughs> Oh, oh, my okay. goodness. <laughs> Guys, you ran two amazing races. Thank you so much for being here. This was yeah. astounding. Thank you so much for having us. That was such an amazing experience. I just, I can't believe this is so well organized and put together. Oh. I have to give kudos to you, Doug. This was amazing. And well, so thank you. Thank you. The, the legendary first mates are such a huge part of making all this oh, stuff yeah. happen. Um, they help me out so much um, with, with all of this. Uh, from the stream to the, the crew communication, um, you know, we've basically been doing the races for a year now, and it's been a real, uh, it's been a real challenge. But um, we're just really excited for the future. Uh, and thank you guys so much for being here. This has been absolutely amazing, um, and we definitely hope you come back someday because you oh, guys 100%. are fantastic at this. <laughs> it was wow. an honor to be on, involved in this. Oh, man, I can't believe it. That was an astounding week. Okay, real quick, um, BB, are you going to be staying on for a little while? No, this is it for me. I'm signing off for the night. Gotcha. Okay, I'm going to try and find somebody on Twitch that's staying on for a little bit. Um, anybody uh, okay. here on Twitch that's staying on? No? Okay, no problem. No. <laughs> just checking, just checking. No, Protuck, you're, you're, not even, you're not live right now, are you? Well, right. Merlin or Coop, weren't, you, weren't one of you going to stay on? Did you, you guys? Nope. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. I can't read Coop. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Rip. 
We don't have the technology. That's okay. That's okay. Anyway, hey, thank you guys so much for being here. This was amazing. What a fantastic week. That Megalodon move in that first race is going to go down in Race of Legends history. Let me assure you. That was um, absolutely nuts. What? I mean, it's always been a, it's been a theory that someone could do that, but we never knew it could be done. Just Mac, thank you very much for the subscription. Thank you so much. I'm going to let you guys get back to it. Thank you so much for joining us. Um, Thank I'm you gonna so much get... for having us. Wow. What, yeah, what a fantastic week this has been. Um, let's see. Crotuck and me are going to jump out to... Oh, not there. To there. Here we go. And let's bring Crotuck down. Almost there. Hold on. Wait for it, guys. I lost Crotuck. I don't know where he went. Oh, there he is. There we go. I found you. I found hey. Crotuck. Okay. All right. So... <laughs> So feel free to follow us on Twitter. Definitely check out the website. Be sure to follow all of the legendary first mates. A huge thank you to Crotuck himself for being here as our legendary co-host. Oh, man, what a week, right? Well, it was my pleasure for sure. Wow. I, what, it, what do you think? Okay, so we've got them. Besides the Megalodon, what, is, what do you think is going to be the thing that sticks out to you the most from this week? Honestly, besides the Megalodon, it's got to be that expert ghost ship, Captain. Yeah, yeah, for sure. That yeah. was so perfectly timed. Yeah. Such a nice angle. That was awesome. Yeah, that was awesome. That that angle that BB and her crew took coming out was amazing. Um, I still, I'm going to have to, but I can't wait for the next Dread Talk to rewatch this stuff. Who um, was that, Marlin? Oh, man. Um, okay, here we go, guys. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to go ahead and rate up Pace. He's live right now on the Sea of Thieves. If you're not familiar oh, with yeah. him, you should definitely check him out. Um, he's got a great channel. And let's go ahead and drop a Raid of Legends. Uh, yeah, it's the Raid of Legends, and I'm embarrassed it took me so many weeks to figure out to call it that. But let, we're going to drop a Raid of Legends with Pace22. Once again, a huge thank you to the legendary first mates. Um, Mike, who is a deckhand, admiral of the camera fleet, he's behind the scenes, guys. But without him, this whole thing would be nuts and impossible for Kaitsu to get the shots that we see. He's the one that makes the stream look so awesome with the transitions and everything. Um, and he's, you know, helped me switch between the views way better than I used to. A huge thank you to Owl, who has been a huge help throughout the week with communicating through the crews. She, again, Owl's someone else who's doing so much stuff behind the scenes. She's way more than just a camera person. Camera Owl. Um, and, <laughs> and a huge thank to, thanks to uh, Quartermaster Zeta for helping us set up the course and for modding in chat. It, I need to start running credits at the end of these things. I really, I'm going to start that next season because it's just such a huge group project to make this happen every week. Um, and it's just so much fun uh, to be able to hang out with everybody in chat. Thank you so much to everyone who's joined us. Have an amazing week. We'll see you one week from tonight for the Curse of Legends. Same place, roughly the same time. Uh, it's going to be experiment for a new event. And the next time you're going to get a chance to see the Race of Legends is going to be in November in the anniversary.